from the Esquimalt Sports Center, a battle of the unbeaten right now. The Edmonton Selects against the Richmond Roadrunners. The Selects in the black and the Roadrunners in the red. Uniforms, Richmond to our broadcast right, Edmonton to our broadcast left. In goal for the Selects, big number 94, Clayton Robertson. And between the pipes for Richmond, Lee Method. And the teams get ready here for the opening faceoff. taken by Edmonton as it goes into their zone going after it is Barabash goes behind his net Chris Barabash tries to work his way out front and rash there spins around Barabash still with it past the neutral zone he's knocked down Richmond takes the ball along the left side Jason Troy scoops it up after a good check. Troy has it. Out in front, nobody there. And the Roadrunners try to bang it out. They can't. Colin Baptiste with the ball. Baptiste hands it back to Jason Troy. Troy, out in front, goes off a stick there and which will Again, trying to get it out to relieve some of the pressure. Baptiste takes it, and the shot clock runs out on Edmonton. Richmond's ball. In the early going here, and as we said, these teams unbeaten so far. They've won their opening two games. The Roadrunners on the offense now with Darcy Dagan down the left side. Takes it into the corner. Dagen looking for somebody in front. Feeds it out in front, but it goes off to the side. Racing after it is Paul Shapka. Shapka takes it, avoids a check. Coming in, shoots. And the stick save by Robertson. Ball bounces ball, uh, back out in front, and the shot clock expires on Richmond. You can't see the shot clock from our angle here. We can only guess how much uh, time is left. But to do our best. The ball in the Richmond zone. That's Dayton Merritt, and the ball's knocked away from him. And the battle for it. Into the corner with Yonita. James Yonita works his way out for the Roadrunners. Pass center into Edmonton territory. Hands it off. A shot there. And the save made off Chris Briggs. Didn't get a very good shot, but Robertson was there to make the stop. Down the floor now is Merritt. Merritt coming in on a Richmond defender. His shot, the save is made by Lee Method. Rebound comes up. Roadrunners racing down the floor. A good pace for this game in the early going. That's Jasinovic. Jasinovic gets around one player, hands it back to Chris Seller. Chris Seller. Over to his right. Richmond working out from the top of the zone here. Out in front. Nice save by Robertson. Richmond again with a chance there. And Robertson again. Johnny on the spot. Eleven minutes to go now in the first period. That's Jason Thompson. Thompson coming in. Backhand scores. Jason Thompson. And the Slux get the game's first goal. Pretty one by number nine, Jason Thompson. Teams face off here with Edmonton now enjoying a 1-0 lead. Richmond wins it. And interference, the ball off the face off there, the ball awarded back to the selects, taking it. Scott Howard hands it off to Sharuga, Matt Sharuga. Takes his time.
Chiruga still with it. Feeds it out off to the side and a shot there that went way over the net by Scott Howard. Chapka checked into the boards. Richmond can control it. The selects break out again. That's Scott Howard. Waits for his teammates to catch up. Howard off to his left to Dottie. Dottie takes a check from Shapka. Dottie out in front. Boldrin just fires it in. It bounces off the back of the boards out in to the slot area where it's scooped up by the Roadrunners. Here they come now with Darcy Dagan. He can't get it. Goes off to the side boards and Darcy picks it up again and he is taken off the ball by Robertson. And the ball goes to Richmond's number 22. There's Shapka over to his right from the circle. There's a shot by number 10, Scott Itchua. Robertson made the easy stick save. Dagan coming in. Off to his right, they score. Jay Haraga. Jay Haraga on the setup from Darcy Dagan. And Haraga ties this game at one apiece. Jason Troy for the selects. Troy hits a Richmond player and was able to get a shot away, but the ball deflects off into the mesh area. They'll face it off to the right of the Richmond net. Seller against Troy on the faceoff, and Edmonton gets it. Dixon Kwan, he hands it off to his left. Intercepted by the Roadrunners. They bang it out in the neutral territory. Now it's back into the Roadrunners zone. Jason Troy works his way in. Off to the side. Long shot and the save is made by Lee Method. Roadrunner is breaking down the floor. From the right side, Chris Seller. Being watched by Baptiste. Seller trying to get it over to Tosinovic, and Tosinovic finally gets it. Takes a check from behind. Tosinovic working the ball. And finally, the shot clock runs out on the Roadrunners. Baptiste. Out in front, right onto a Richmond stick. Yonita. Or uh, rather Daniel Plant, that is, takes a hard check and falls down. He's on the floor right now, gets up. And on that play, we've got a penalty assessed now to Edmonton as Daniel Plant was Knocked down. Ty Sticking is the call. So Richmond goes in the power play with 5.55 to go in the opening period. A one-all tie between these two unbeaten teams. Scott Ichiwa carries the ball over the blue line, then lost it. The selects 
Short-handed on a bit of a break here with Thompson. And he can't do anything with it. The Roadrunners now with their captain number five, Darcy Dagan. Feeds it out in front, they score! Jay Haraga. The Dagan Haraga combination strikes again for Richmond as uh, Dagan found Haraga all alone in front of the Edmonton net and he poked it home to give the Roadrunners a two to one lead, a power play goal for Richmond. Dagan threatens again. Chapka with it, over to his right. That's Yonita, gets checked into the boards. Chapka picks it up. Chapka being worked over by a couple Edmonton players. That's Yonita. Bounces a shot into Robertson. Robertson, a long, looping pass. Down the left side, Sean Barr. Gets past a couple of Richmond players, takes a shot, and they score! Sean Barr. And we're all squared away here, two goals apiece. Sean Barr, the goal scorer for Edmonton there. From the faceoff, Richmond gets it. That's Jerome Schmidt working his way in. Schmidt takes a shot that bounces wide of the goal off to the side. The Roadrunners trying to do something here. There's Schmidt being harassed, but gets a shot away. That drifts wide. Comes all the way back to the Richmond bench area. Taken by Ichawa. And his pass intercepted by the selects and they bang it out to neutral territory where it's taken by number 17, Scott Howard. Howard. Doing some dipsy doodling. To his right to Barabash. He lost it momentarily, picks it back up. Barabash and his pass out in the slot area goes into the corner. And finally the shot clock runs out on the selects. The Roadrunners on a break here. Two on one. Plant with the shot and the save made by Robertson. It bangs out to the selects. Scott Howard ahead to Dixon Quan. Quan coming in. And he's knocked off the ball. The Roadrunners now march down the floor. Chris Seller it was waiting for a pass from Tosinovic. Tosinovic then can't get it out to him. It'll be awarded to Richmond. Richmond's ball here. And Tosinovic will take it with a minute and 45 to go in the first period. Off to his right to Yonita. Yonita. The circle area comes back to Yonita. Yonita coming in. Scores! Number 33, you see him there. James Yonita puts the Roadrunners in front 3-2. Meantime, we have an injured Richmond player on the floor by the far circle to the left of Edmonton goalkeeper Robertson. We'll stop the clock here. James Yonita from Mark Sunovic and Jay Haraga. That last scoring play for the Roadrunners as they intend to the injured Richmond player on the floor.
good game so far. Very quick pace to it. And as we expected, uh, a very close battle. These teams undefeated so far. Edmonton, the bigger squad, but Richmond, a very quick ball club. And the Richmond player gets up and slowly walks back to his bench. We'll try and see who that is for the Roadrunners. I think that uh, was Jay Haraga. Okay, they're now set for the faceoff. The selects take it. And they get knocked down and a little pushing and shoving in front of the end of the net there. And we got a penalty coming up to Richmond. Sticking to Daniel Plant, so the Roadrunner is shorthanded for the next two minutes. Now we'll extend into the second period as long as the Slugs don't get a power play goal here. Jason Thompson being watched by Darcy Dagan. Dagan takes it away and bangs it out to the center area, comes back into Richmond territory. That's Rochefort. Rochefort is knocked down hard, and Richmond takes the ball. With play running out here in the first period, just 10 seconds to go. Darcy Dagan on the far right side, and that will end the first period. Richmond on two goals by Jay Haraga, one by James Yonita, leading the Edmonton Selects 3-2 after one period of play. Getting underway here momentarily between Edmonton and uh, Richmond with the Roadrunners in front by a score of 3-2 and Richmond is shorthanded for the first part of the second period. Daniel Plant still in the box with a minute and 15 seconds to serve and his high sticking penalty. Dagen against Troy on or Dagen against Thompson on the faceoff. Dagen takes it. Dagen coming in from the far side, stops at the circle. Takes a check, still has it. Feeds it back to the point. Dagen still with it uh, in the corner now. for somebody in front, just pulling off some more penalty time here. Only 45 seconds left now in the highest sticking infraction to Daniel Plant. Great job of penalty killing by Darcy Dagan. Being watched by Thompson behind the net. The slut just can't get it away from him. Dagan. Still has it, goes behind the net. Out in front, Sinovic, his shot goes wide, and finally the selects get possession with just 10 seconds left in their power play. Long lead pass for Scott Howard, goes ahead of him all the way to Lee Method. The Roadrunner goaltender puts it behind the net, the selects take it, loose ball. 
And as Plant comes back onto the floor, the ball awarded back to the Roadrunners. This Lux with it, Thompson, his shot. Save is made by Method. Second period, just two minutes gone. The Roadrunners break out with Chris Gilfillan, number 22. He feeds it back to Haraga, who has two goals in this game. Yonita. Being checked there by Dayton Merritt. Yonita takes it into the corner. Goes out in front of the net, a backhand shot goes wide. And the ball is knocked into the mesh area above the glass by Richmond, so Edmonton takes it. A pass by Richard Stevens, intercepted by the Roadrunners, number 11, Chris Seller. And the loose ball is then picked up by the Selects again. Into Richmond territory. Stevens. His shot bounces wide. Matt Chiruga scoops it up. Chiruga as Howard moves into the slot area. And Howard picks it up. Shoot. Scores. Oh, nice goal by Scott Howard. As he worked his way into the slot area. Waited for the pass, got it, and fired it into the top right-hand corner past Lee Method, and it's now a 3-3 tie. <laughs> Scott Howard getting Edmonton even in this game. Stuff at the faceoff circle of the center there, and we're getting minor penalties assessed to both teams. Roughing penalties, offsetting roughing minors. But both teams will play four aside here for the next two minutes. Dagen has it. Dagen to his right to Yonita. Yonita takes a high stick from Sean Barr. Penalty coming up. Yonita still has it. Looking for Dagen, who's all alone in the slot area. Goes back to Dagen, winds up, and the stick saved by Robertson. Penalty coming up to Edmonton. Sean Barr going off for high sticking. Now a four on three situation for Richmond for the next minute and 15 seconds or so. Dagen out in front, a shot by 27 Haraga. Just, just misses barely. The Dagen Haraga combination has been lethal for the Roadrunners so far. We'll face it off to the right of Robertson. Dagen wins it, being checked there by Troy. They battle for it. Ball comes loose. Gil Fillin behind the net. To Haraga. Goes back to Ichawa. Over to Gil Fillin. Back out in front again. A shot by Haraga. The save is made. And the selects desperately trying to get it out. Trying to kill off his penalty. Still a minute to go in the power play. There's Haraga coming in. Haraga gives it back to Gilfillan. Bounces a shot into Robertson. 
and Robertson tried to clear it down the floor, it went off the ceiling. Ball given back to Richmond. Ichiwa, the road runner, is threatening again. Shot goes wide. 35 seconds now left in the Richmond power play. The select's coming out with Jason Troy. Big Jason Troy. Gets past Saraga, his shot goes wide. Bounces off the boards. Darcy Dagan picks it up for the Roadrunners, takes a check and the ball bounces into the Richmond bench off Haraga. So Edmonton gets possession. Eight minutes and two seconds to go in the second period, a 3-3 tie. Great game here at the Scottmont Sports Center between these two unbeaten teams. The selects. Sean Barr takes the pass. Barr spins around. Tried to pass it over to Troy. Or to number 12, that was Richard Stevens. The selects get a shot away that goes wide. Both teams now at even strength as the Edmonton penalty has expired. The Slux coming in again with Matt Rochefort and he was knocked down. And we've got a tripping penalty now coming up to Richmond. Two penalties coming up to Richmond, a tripping penalty and a high sticking penalty. Dagen going off for tripping, Haraga going off for high sticking. So the Roadrunners now will be two men short and uh, from Edmonton's point of view, what better players to have in the box than Darcy Dagen and Jay Haraga. The selects a shot there by Bodron, he scores. Dallas Bodron. And the Slux now take a four to three lead on that goal by Vodron. Dagen is still in the penalty box, so the selects still with the man advantage here. Work their way past center. That's Sharuga, Sharuga coming in. And his shot goes well over the crossbar. Another attempt. Bounces off into the corner, taken by Davies. Gareth Davies looking for somebody in front. Gets it back to Howard. Howard. Got Voldren on his left. And goes into the corner, a shot by 77, Sharuga goes wide. And the ball bounces off an Edmonton stick into the stands. Richmond takes possession, 5.50 now to go in the opening period. The Roadrunners with Schmidt. Gilfillan ahead of him over on his left. Goes back to the point to Ichawa. Ichawa, Gil Fillon, and Schmidt up front for Richmond as they still try to kill off some penalty time here. Ball goes into the corner taken by Dallas Bodrum. Eighteen seconds left now in the Edmonton power play. Jason Thompson takes the shot. Goes about 10 feet wide, rebound, and that one goes wide. Vodron, six save by Method. Taken by Daniel Plant behind his own net. The penalty has expired. Both teams now at even strength and racing after it is Dagan as he came out of the penalty box. Dagan against Robertson, and Dagan gives Robertson a bit of a cross check. Out to center now, Jason Thompson over to his right. Ball goes into the corner. 
Taken by Sharuga. Sharuga. Back to the point to Thompson. Thompson gets a shot away that goes wide. Rebound picked up by Sharuga. Sharuga in the front, in front to 25, Rochefort. And he couldn't tuck it home. 4-3 Edmonton. Four minutes to go in the second period. Gil Fillin for the Roadrunners. The seller. Yonita. Ball is poked away from him by Sean Barr, and Barr takes it. Barr coming in against three Richmond defenders. Hands it back to Richard Stevens. Stevens with possession. He takes a shot off the legs of Method into the corner. The selects buzzing around the Richmond net. Comes back to Thompson. Out in the slot area, shot by Howard is stopped by Method. The Roadrunner is now on the attack. Chris Seller drops the ball, tries to scoop it up again, goes into the corner with Stevens. And now we have a bit of a break there for Edmonton, but that stops. Dayton Merritt will take over with a new 30 on the shot clock. Merritt, backhand shot, goes well over the crossbar behind the Richmond net, taken by the Roadrunners. They try to get it out, they can't. That's Merritt again. Merritt spins around, tries to take another backhand shot. That attempt is foiled. And the Roadrunners with Haraga coming in. One on one on Thompson. His shot goes past the crossbar. Rebound. Great save by Robertson off Chris Seller. Chomka takes it in the corner, takes a check there from Merritt, comes out, kicked out by Robertson. Loose ball, Haraga, and he had an open net there, partially open net, and he couldn't put it in. Sean Barr. Barr down the left side, stops, turns around, over to his right, Stevens goes wide. Bar on the rebound, right into the stomach of Lee Method. And he just hands it back with a minute and six seconds to go now. That's little Paul Shapka for the Roadrunners. Finally falls down and They have a penalty coming up. No, they're just awarding the ball back to Richmond. That's Darcy Dagen in the corner. Thirty-five seconds to go here. Dagen has to do something pretty quick. Gil Fillin, his shot stopped. The selects with Robertson's pass going off the boards, bouncing all the way to the penalty box area, taken by Ichawa. Shapka spins around Troy, gets past, tries to get past Thompson. Six seconds to go now, a final rush for the selects. That's Jason Troy coming in, two seconds left. He's got to shoot, and he does, but it goes off the post. Nice try by Jason Troy. As time was running out. The second period now over the score, Edmonton four and the Richmond Roadrunners three. The third period faceoff, four three for the selects. Jason Thompson, Scott Howard, Dallas Vodron, 
Sean Barr scoring for Edmonton, Jay Haraga with two, and James Yonita replying for the Roadrunners. A very well played game here. From the face off the ball. Given to Edmonton on the right off the face off, Jason Troy. Troy being watched by Schmidt. Troy spins around a couple times. Still has it looking for an opening. Troy coming in from the far side goes into the corner behind the net now. Jason Troy still hanging on to it. Time running out in the shot clock. And indeed that's what happens as 30 seconds runs out. Roadrunners with possession. The ball gets ahead of Chris Seller, goes into the corner. Seller and Barabash battling forward in the corner. And Barabash will take it out. Barabash down the right side. Barabash over, trying to get it over to his left and it's poked away momentarily, but he regains possession. Barabash finally loses it. Richmond can't clear it out. Under pressure here early in the third period. Now they get it out to neutral territory. Daniel Plant checked by two Edmonton players and Plant will take it. New 30 on the shot clock. Plant to number four to Sinovic. Sinovic being harassed there. Hands it back to Gil Fillin. Gil Fillin into the corner of Dagan. Dagan out in front, a shot by Seller. Goes wide, and another shot goes well up into the stands. The selects now with possession. Coming down the floor, that's Colin Baptiste. Baptiste, one on one, comes in, scores. Colin Baptiste. Well, they're not awarding that a goal as he was in the crease area. In the meantime, they've got an injured Richmond player. An injured Richmond player that we're looking at right now on the screen. He's down. That occurred... Uh, That occurred behind the play. <laughs> Looks like he injured his knee as they attend to him. The stoppage in play occurring with two and a half minutes gone in the third period. The Edmonton players gather at their bench. Richmond player, we'll see who it is when he turns around and we can see his number. Hobbles back to the bench, that's number 30, Daniel Plant. Injured his right leg or his right knee. He's helped back to the bench. 
So it's still 4-3 Edmonton. And Richmond will take the ball from their own zone. Dagen on the left. Tosinovic. Yonita. Ball bounces behind the selects net, taken by Edmonton. Now they work it out. Thompson, pass center. Coming in on two Richmond defenders. Thompson tries to get a backhand away and can't do it. Roadrunners intercept and they come down the floor with Chris Briggs. Briggs being checked hard by Rochefort. And the ball is knocked loose. Comes back to Dagen. The Roadrunner is now in Edmonton territory, working the ball around. Shot by Gilfillan right onto an Edmonton stick. They lose it, comes out in front. Dagen pounces on the loose ball. Dagen gets it back again on the pass from Gilfillan. Over to Yonita, his shot. That bounces about 20 feet wide. And the selects take it. Jason, or number 12, Richard Stevens. Stevens being knocked around a bit. But still hangs onto it. Out in front, a shot, that goes wide. Bounces into the corner. The Roadrunners can't get it out. The selects in front of Richmond's net. And finally the ball intercepted by the Roadrunners. A one-on-one -on -one break. There's Dagen coming in all alone now. Dagen on the breakaway. Bounces it. And the save is made. He tried to bounce it in past Robertson. And Clayton comes up with a big stop. Darcy Dagen a big scoring threat for Richmond, and he almost connected there. The selects with it. Dayton Merritt passes over to Sharuga. Sharuga to the side of the net, goes off the stick of Sean Barr. And Barr puts a cross check to the Richmond player, so the Roadrunners will take the ball. Center. That's Sinovic. Over to his left. Out in front, a shot by Seller off the post. Chris Seller rattled one off the post and he slams the stick down in frustration. That ball then bounced up into the stands and the selects will take it. Although face it off here. Eight fifty-three to go in the game. Four three Edmonton. Jerome Schmidt. To Seller. Goes wide. On the rebound, Seller fanned on it. They score. Jerome Schmidt. Schmidt had a couple had a couple of whacks at it. The rebound, about the third rebound or second rebound, came out to Schmidt and he fired it home. So we now have a 4-4 tie. These teams will go right down to the wire. Troy has it. Troy coming in from the far side, gets it out in front to Davies. Davies with a chance. Bounces wide. Troy picks it up in the corner. He loses it. 
And a little bit of slashing there by Troy. And the Roadrunners get the ball back. Four four tie, Dagan in front. As the ball bounces off his stick onto the stick of Jason Troy. Troy coming in on a partial breakaway. Now he's all alone. Troy scores. Jason Troy finds the far side. And what a game we have here. 5-4 Edmonton selects leading Richmond with 6.40 to go in the third period. Merritt and Yonita racing for it. Yonita finally gets it. Works his way around the side. Yonita out to center. Seller has Schmidt on his left, gives it to Schmidt. Schmidt puts on the brakes. Over to his right to Yonita. Over to Schmidt again. And finally, they just run out of time. The shot clock expires on the Roadrunners, not able to get a shot away. So the selects back with possession. Richard Stevens, the ball carrier. Takes a shot in the head. Stevens now behind the Richmond net. The ball is knocked loose. Plant with a good checking job there for the Roadrunners. But uh, on the infraction, the ball was given back to Edmonton. A shot stopped made by Method. Here come the Roadrunners again. Jerome Schmidt, and he's cross-checked by Thompson. Penalty coming up, and we have a high-sticking call here to Jason Thompson. And it appears we have two Richmond penalties, or two Edmonton penalties. Okay, Matt Rochefort goes off for slashing. We missed that one, but uh, Jason Thompson also off for high sticking. So Edmonton, two men short here with 4.55 to go. The Roadrunners trying to tie it up with a golden opportunity here. Dagen. The save is made off him by Robertson. Edmonton breaking out now. That's Matt Sharuga doing a great job. Down on the left side, he's knocked down. Then just rifles it into the corner. Rebound comes out in front. Oh, tremendous save by Method. Dagen racing down the floor. Over to his right, a shot by Schmidt. Gil Fillon has it. Haraga got a shot away. Into the corner, Gil, uh, Gil Fillon and Haraga for Richmond. That's Ichawa. Ichawa looking for a shot. Robertson Johnny on the spot again, and <laughs> in his clearing pass, he hit the ceiling. Richmond takes the ball. Robertson having trouble with this short ceiling here at the sports center. There's Chris Seller in the slot. Takes a bouncing shot that goes into the corner. Haraga gets it back to Gil Fillon. Gil Fillon out in front. Stick saved by Robertson. Rebound taken by the selects. They just fire it down. Trying to kill off more penalty time. And now just 30 seconds to go in the two-man advantage for Richmond. Coming down the floor again. From the right side, a shot. That goes wide. And up to the ceiling where 
They give the ball back to Clayton Robertson, and again, he rifles it off the ceiling. And just two seconds left in the penalties. Edmonton now at even strength. They score, Jay Haraga. This game all squared away at five goals apiece. Jay Haraga and Dagen combining again there. Dagen with the pass. Haraga put it in from the side of the net. And that's the third goal of this game for Haraga. Richmond pressing again with Chris Briggs to Schmidt. Schmidt coming in. Save is made. Rebound comes out of a backhand attempt there. That is foiled and here come the selects. Richard Stevens over to his left. To Troy, Troy goes into the corner with it. Gets it back to Thompson in front. Thompson takes a couple of checks, loses the ball, and Richmond will take possession with 2.24 left in the third period. Too far ahead of Plant, but he Gets the ball off the boards. Plant being checked by Rochefort. Rochefort knocks it away. But it goes to Tosinovic. Tosinovic around the circle. To the side of the net. Dagen takes a shot that goes to the other corner. Troy is there to pick it up for Edmonton. Troy being watched by Plant. Breaks loose. Down the left side. Jason Troy over to Rochefort. Spins around. Trying to get a shot away. Ball is knocked away and slapped, but not out. Kept in by Stevens. Stevens coming in. He had some interference in the slot area. Roadrunners get the ball back. There's Dagen on the right side. Dagen one on one. Shoot, score! Dorsey Dagen putting Richmond in front six to five on the breakaway and we've got a wild finish here in this one between Richmond and Edmonton now six to five for the Roadrunners they were down five to four they couldn't score with that two-man advantage they had a few minutes ago but they get two quick goals after that Final minute and a half here. Richmond content on just running down the clock. Chris Seller mauled there by Mark Dotty of Edmonton. Seller gets back up, has the ball, goes into the corner with it, takes a check from Sean Barr, and we've got a penalty coming up here, I believe, to Edmonton. Sean Barr is going off. Now well, we've got two Edmonton players going off. So again, Edmonton, two men shorthanded. John Barr and Mark Dotty going off. And that's a terrible time for Edmonton to take a couple penalties. Now they're short-handed for the rest of this ball game. Jerome Schmidt. Daniel Plant from the side. His shot is blocked. He's back to Dagen. To Schmidt. Or to uh, Yonita. <laughs> well, we'll get it right. That was uh, that was Daniel Plant with the shot. And his rifle down on the floor by Edmonton. Just 40 seconds to go in the third period. And in the game, 6-5 for Richmond. They've got the two-man advantage. Jerome Schmidt over to his right to Dagen. Dagen 
Takes a shot. Scores. Dorsey Dagen bounces it in with just 20 seconds to go, and this one pretty much in the bag now for Richmond, a 7-5 lead. Edmonton with it. Matt Rochefort. Rochefort gets it into the slot, but it's taken there by the Roadrunners, and they'll just kill off the rest of the time left. The horn blows, and the elated Richmond players racing to their goaltender, Lee Method. Very happy Richmond team, and so they should be. They came back from a 5-4 deficit in the third period to beat Edmonton 7-5. The two teams will shake hands. We'll stay for the player of the game selections, one player chosen from each team. Running down the goal scorers, we had Jay Haraga with a hat trick for Richmond. Darcy Dagen had two and two very big goals. Jerome Schmidt a single and James Yonita also scored. And for Edmonton, it was Jason Thompson, Scott Howard, Dallas Vodron, Jason Troy, and Sean Bars. Seven to five, and Richmond stays unbeaten. Edmonton suffers their first loss. Lining up for the two stars that will be selected. One from Richmond, one for Edmonton. And I guess we're still deciding about it right now. Now we're ready for the Stars to be announced. <laughs> Lee Method, the goalkeeper, gets the nod for Richmond. Matthew Sharuga for Edmonton. So there you have it, the two stars. And this one is in the books, the final score, the Richmond Roadrunners seven, the Edmonton selects five.